begin with this breaking news out of University City where students at Vance High School say they were kept on lockdown for more than an hour after a massive fight on campus. From Chopper 9, we saw several officers parked around that school today. Our Tina Terry was there as parents came by the school to pick up their kids. She's live for us tonight. Tina? Oh yeah, guys, one mom told us that she saw police cars rushing to the school, so she followed them here. And once she got on campus, she learned about that huge fight. Take a look. Now, this is video posted to social media of that huge fight on the campus. Uh, you can see and hear that dozens of people seem to be involved and dozens of others appear to be recording it. Now, we have blurred the video so that you can't see the students' faces. Chopper 9 Sky Zoom flew overhead and we could see officers walking a person in handcuffs to a patrol car outside. Concerned parents rushed to pick up their kids. Students told us administrators locked down the school this afternoon for more than an hour during that fight. At least one student said a gun was involved. I asked CMPD about this. They confirmed the fight, but CMS said they don't have any information confirming a gun was involved. Gun or no gun, parents and students say this has to stop. I'm definitely not happy about it. You want your kids to be in a safe environment a comfortable learning environment where they can focus on academics and learning. It was just like the whole situation was just like scary, like I didn't want to be here. Yeah, and we did talk to uh, police and we asked if that person who was being escorted to the patrol car was involved in that fight. And anyway, we're still waiting on an answer to that. The principal did send a message out to parents and in that message it said any student violating the code of student conduct will be disciplined. We will continue digging into this. We'll pass on any information we receive. Back to you guys. All right, Tina Terry Force live in University City tonight. Tina, thanks.